And thanks for your comment. And yeah, that's everyone would like to help the small businesses because with all the pandemic, the shutdowns, all the nonsense, really it's mom and pop businesses. Uh, and, and there's no exclusion, right? Whether it's minority or not, everyone's getting hammered and the small companies are hurting the most. The small farmers are hurting the most. Uh, a lot of people don't realize, at least some of the farmers I knew, they had to sell. Like, they they sold because they couldn't make a living. Um, I'm sure so, some sold that agreed, as some comments pointed out. But a lot of them sold because they just, they had to. Um, what you If you want to make a difference, you want to change the, I guess, the dynamic of how this goes down. The best way to do it is solicit smaller businesses cut the middleman out go to the farmers markets go to the private restaurants um i I just actually sassy and i drove about halfway across texas we're in temple texas which is really cool a really pretty town i like it here and um you know they're instead of going to you know chain restaurant x i found a little italian joint downtown it's called pignetti's uh probably one of the best chicken marsalas i've had in years and I'm a guy who's lived in New York and New Orleans, so yeah, that's that's a pretty high bar. Um, they really impressed me. But you know, do stuff like that. Go to these little restaurants, go to these little farmers markets, uh, get to know some of these farmers. Uh, even out in West Texas, when we have those big farmers markets, um, a lot of those ranchers live within a couple hours of us, uh, or they travel to the event. So get to know them. Um, a lot of them are getting techie, right? They have a website, so if you really like their broccoli or you really like their beef, place an order online in advance, and then when you make it to the event, uh, they'll earmark it for you, right? So some of them can even ship. So start looking for those ways. Now, you're doing two things when you do that. One, you're helping a small business or a small farm. But two, you're shortening your supply chain a lot. And that also helps you personally with availability so in any case guys you know travel safe this weekend you guys be careful with what you're doing uh and go check out the farmers markets go check out those little uh, antique shops find the small businesses see if you can help them out and if nothing else you make some friends and find neat shit all right you guys be good i will see you all later